And Lauren Kelly is introducing us to a one-of-a-kind artist who transforms ordinary pieces of wood into some masterpieces. All right, Lauren, what is going on? Derek and Courtney, we have some very talented people in Houston. We are out in Dickinson today. Look at this. This was carved by a chainsaw by this beautiful lady over there. The chainsaw chick is going to show us exactly how she does it. Coming up on the show today. I'm ready. She's got that chainsaw. She's ready, too. That's coming up, you guys. Don't want to miss this one. Oh, my goodness. I was not expecting that. Oh the chainsaw God. chick. The I like it. Chainsaw chick. Very, very nice. All right. Well, who's creating something really special for us this afternoon. All right. We hear it, Lauren. How's it going? You guys, I know you just mentioned viral. She went viral as well for making a JJ Watt sculpture. But I bet you can tell what she might be already making. We're going to get to the finished product from the chainsaw chick a little bit later on the show. You should like to return in just two minutes. Welcome back. You know, some artists use paint brushes, some use clay to sculpt their art. What about a chainsaw? It sounds totally reasonable to me. I think so. But a bad idea for you. Local artist <laughs> Della Meredith has been carving unique pieces of wooden art for many years. And Lauren Kelly is live in Dickinson this afternoon with the chainsaw chick. Lauren, this is pretty cool. Let me just tell you something. This girl is so talented. We gave her less than an hour to create and finish pretty much a masterpiece. Now, there are finishing touches that she hasn't put on it yet, like the color and, and the little details in the star. Right. But Della, this is amazing. Thank you. How did you get into carving wood with a chainsaw? Um, I was actually just trying to make tiki's and so I started using chisels and different tools and it was taking a while so but I you just, have a background in art right you went to school yes, for I it. went to college for art and I took a lot of shop classes so I had you know a background using tools. Let me tell you something when everybody heard that we were going to be carving wood with a chainsaw I'm pretty sure they did not expect to see you behind it and <laughs> it's just so awesome to see some of your other pieces you went viral for doing a JJ Watt piece did yes. JJ ever reach out and say that's amazing um, he posted it on his Twitter awesome. he reposted it and he said it was cool I mean this is so cool so how long would this normally take you to complete um, probably like a couple of hours a couple more than just 45 minutes right, right. I mean I still <laughs> need to grind it and do like the uh, dremeling and sealing and painting and, and all that, that gives it that shiny finished just bright and colorful look right yes. so what is one of the pieces that you've done like some of these I just can I point out this sure. right here this you guys she did <laughs> with a chainsaw how long did it take you to make this jacket um, that took a couple of days because I had to, I mean, it has a lot of detail on it, so I, and I painted it also, so it took a little uh, while. Della, I've seen the size of chainsaw teeth, and I don't know how <laughs> you got in here and made these teeny tiny teeth. It's just really, really incredible, Thank and you. you sell your pieces as well, right? Yes. How many would you say you have sold now over the years? I don't know. I've I've made a bunch. I think about that sometimes, and I have I don't even know. Just, just a, just a lot, just nonstop. So what would be something that you haven't created yet that you're dying to try to make? Ooh, um, I've actually, I made one seahorse, but I like making seahorses. Um, something that I want to make. I don't know. <laughs> you should try to make a, a Derek and a Courtney bust. I think our two co-hosts oh. would, would look really nice in a, in a wooden carving, but it'll give yeah. you a project to work on later okay. in your career. Thank you so much for sharing your art. Again, yeah. I just, I'm looking at these totems that the detail, it's just by watching you work is pretty incredible. Here's an actual fish, Texas. This has got a fish on it. You made these too, correct? Those are trophies for a tournament. Trophies, of course they are. Well, Della Merida, thank you so much thank again. You. The chainsaw chick, I definitely I'm going to follow you for more. I got to watch how this comes out. The Texas looks All awesome. Right. Derek and Courtney, what do you think? Is that not amazing? Amazing. Yes. She is so talented. Oh Super cool. Lauren Kelly, thank you so much. Della's like, no, sure. I'm not going to make Derek and Courtney. I'll make another dragon. <laughs>